Welcome everyone to Lion's Den. I am Rogan O'Callaghan and this is my broadcast partner. Why thank you very much for uh, introducing me here. And well, ladies and gentlemen, I am, uh, excuse, excuse me, I may have forgot my name here for some second. Because you know, this is Lion's Den. I am so excited, especially for this main event that we have, which is Shea Knight and Alexis Rubor, the happy couple as I see on the sheet, versus Koyo O'Callaghan and Avalon. Truly, I battle between the two love, love stories within our community and within this whole wrestling industry. These two will put to see if their love for each other can help each other overcome each other's uh, conflict and see who is truly the star couple in Ka. Ah. Well, at the moment, we now have our first match of the night here, which is... Oh! Wait, what? All right. Lights has gone. Well, well, we'll leave it out. Um, do we get someone in the back there? Oh, uh, wait. Sorry about that. Kenny <laughs> Young. Our first competitor tonight in our opening match, Mr. Sammy Young. This uh, centric individual is uh, most certainly popular with the audience. And it's uh, quite evident from the reaction we're getting here. Uh, traveled, traveled well around the world. And, very in the enigmatic style that he brings to the ring. Uh, very much looking forward to seeing this man in the ring, what he's capable of bringing. It seems like, as I can uh, see from how this man looks, how this man is wearing, how this man is attitude is, it seems like he had like a troubled past back in his son when he was a young one, but now it looks like he seems to uh, put out all his anger all to his opponent, or to whoever it is. And that cannot be a good thing for whoever it may be, you know. And tonight, that opponent, Keith Mayshard, we'll see how he uh, can handle the anger and passion this man brings to the ring. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure Keith Mayshard can handle it. He that remains to be seen. <laughs> what do you mean, remains to be seen? I'm pretty sure this man, Keith Mayshard, can do whatever he can, whether his opponent is angry, happy, hey. Maybe even sad, whatever the heck it may be. Here he comes now. One of the more, uh, how shall we put it, controversial members of this whole wrestling federation and this uh, wrestling company and beyond and many others. This man everywhere he has gone, he has been center of controversy. Has been a man that has brought a reaction from, from his fans and opponents and delivered on the highest standards as well. But he, he is going up against a man in Sammy Young here tonight who is, I, I believe, one of the most passionate men in that ring. Who is, I do not think he is capable of, of shutting him down. It remains to be seen if, if he can rise to the task as you uh, claim he will. Hey, everybody knows that whatever I say is true. And whoa, 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 whoa. Who, 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 who the hell doing? is this? This is, a, I think that's Kingdom Star. What, what's he doing here? What's that flat blob of a person doing here? <laughs> flat blob? He's only five feet away, man. <laughs> Don't be in current route. Oh, keep me shared, though. Um, that was soaking wrong. Up the <laughs> soaking up the hate. <laughs> As I'm saying that, he's a big fan of submissions and grappling, which is looking to be shown here in this match, hopefully. His hard-hitting moves very, are... Dis very disrespectful to our referee. And uh, Sammy, rightly so, putting him in his place into a headlock and into reverse, reverse, elbow to the back of the head. 
Yep. That, that'll show him now to go uh, patronising to the up, oh, keep Nish hard. Ah, oh, an elbow of his own. Any any strike that he does can end the match at any moment, but it seems like Sammy Young looking to uh, not stay down as he should. Oh! He just he totally uh, caught him off guard with that one and a takedown into the pin. Ref score what? Oh, not even a one count that time. Mayshard take a lot more to put a guy of his caliber down, but you see, Keith, you see, Keith Mayshard knows what he's doing. He knows what he can. He does not stay down for the two count. Yeah. Anything sooner? Into side headlock. He has a uh, control here now into reverse to the back. Oh, he up he goes down. down. Off the backdrop. And oh, look at this. A, oh, this is this is just putting his foot on a Sammy Young. I, and you you implore on these kind of tactics. That that was not the smugness. He could have gotten a better pin out of that. He didn't even get a one count. He's going for it again. This is uh, this is very, very disrespectful. Disrespectful. Him. This is him being smart, just taking him down. Oh my goodness! Bit of impact in that one. Oh, he's feeling the effects on his head. Oh, oh no. Wow. Here we go, here we go now. Bringing the pace. This is where I'm saying oh Well first electronic drop from Keith Mayshard. Cut him off. And oh into an uh, here into we an go. Armbar. A Fujiwara Referee armbar. And, oh, it is. Quick out of it. Lovely. Reverse it out there. Boom! Oh! Oh! Keith that feeling the effects of that one on the side of the back of the head when he took the impact down. And oh. Just following up by brutally striking on him. This is the passion we were talking about with Sammy Young. This is this is, close, this is close. This is close fist he's using against Keith Mayshaw. The referee should do something about that. Well, he's choosing to let it go on from the indiscretions that maybe Keith Mayshard was showing towards the ref in the beginning of the match. Because everybody oh. knows that nobody wanted to touch Sammy Young. Just lighting him up there with chops, though. Look at him. He's just filthy, dirty, and disgusting. Straight right down disgusting. <laughs> Are you are you sure you should be antagonizing the competitors in this kind of way? He is looking at this man lighting up Keith Mayshard. His chest must be just burning up inside right now at this point. And you antagonizing a man like this. You, he will be watching the show afterwards, you, you are aware of. And as I understand it, uh, he is uh, quite passionate. Oh, look at this! <laughs> Disrespect! <laughs> And look at Keith Mitchell just rolling out of the ring, just being smart, just and this, piss this off to the fans. Disrespecting our audience. Yeah, Sammy Young standing up for these fans and the people truly appreciating it and showing it, showing it here. Oh, right he better run on. now. Mayshar back in the ring. Sammy follows. Oh, oh no! Takes him down with the new ten. Close fist shots once again. Are you serious? More, more. It's it's what seems to be working here, and it's not illegal here in Lions Den. One count that time, and anything that's not illegal is open fair game to be used, as you well know. Sure. Got him on it's the side. Oh, come on! Kick to the gut! Seems like I, he's some kind of dog. Here we go now. Here we go now. Oh, miss! Wait, make sure catches Ooh. him. Look at this. Oh, my God. That was a nasty tumble he took to the floor. Meshar, again with more disrespect. And he's firmly in control now at this point. Hard whip into the barricade, and, and you you here talking about the closed fist? What is this you're seeing right in front of you? Hey, he is not using closed fist in the ring, okay? Oh, all right. Uh, you you have a double standard for the proximity you're in the ring. Well, if that's the approach you're going to take on it, we can uh, we'll we'll leave that as a disagreement. Oh my God, what's he doing here? Oh! oh! <laughs> Oh my God, Sammy Young is taking some serious punishment on his spine. That is about the fifth backdrop or fourth backdrop he's after taking with serious impact. But this Keith time, it's just like outside the ring. Brutality may be Sammy Young's best, but Keith Mayshard know how to do it himself. Oh, he is he is showing it. Oh, oh Brazilians what? showing here from Sammy Young. That probably More made him strong. Drag. This high octane pace being up to notch, and Sammy Young off the knee into the arm. Going oh, to the arm. Drop down. Something Working. that Keith Mishar likes to do is go for some missions here. But it seems like Sam Young can do the same thing as well. And you have to keep in mind, if he takes away Keith Mishar's ability and strength in using those arms, it's only got to weaken the submission power he has. Oh! Really working the joints and those elbows and ligaments. Stretching and pulling and tearing at them. In my theory, I believe that Mishar's arm probably would have been broken after that. But it seems like Sammy Young... Being the disgusting, filthy bastard that he is, just going right to it again. Uh, I know you are using 
very coarse language on a, on a competitor here who is working completely within the confines of the rules of the, of the match. Oh, and a oh. back flex out of his own. Bit of Keith Mayshard's own medicine used against him. Into the side headlock. Oh, not again. again. He, is, he is repaying it back with double the amount of velocity and power. This is the passion we're talking about. This man is... He is going to town on Keith Mayshard, wearing him down with the backdrops and working the arm. Oh! Big boot to the face. Here's the cover. I, I'm not, I'm oh, not liking near, this whatsoever. Near, near fall there. Keith Mayshard must be feeling the effects there. He only, he kicked out with, in a very unconvincing oh. oh! Drop kick to the outside. Mayshard is reeling here. Maybe tell him this to get up. You look at the fly. The well, I don't think you want to turn your back on Keith. Wait a second. Oh! oh unpadded oh knee in another. You can just feel, you can just see it in his face there at that moment. That pain he, he's getting on, right on the jaw, dropping him down with that knee. And Mayshare. Wait What's this set up? Oh, right to the rubber. Oh! This is, that is a, that is a hard move to watch. That is a, right on the small of his back and all the work that oh my god Mayshard is he is just tearing his spine and back muscles apart and, oh barely kicked out with a near fall again I don't think he should have kicked out that he just he should have just stayed down for the job he's he's taking an awful lot of abuse here from Mayshard here I'm one can only up. imagine like after that them flurries and they, oh my god big Yakuza kick and look at this a single leg I believe that's a camel clutch. It's a modified camel clutch here, but oh my god, and it's the way he he's just really like those exposed knees and he's just making full use of them here on poor Sammy Young like him. Here's as you were alluding to earlier, the arm wrench by Mayshard. He has control. Setting him up. Familiar predicament that uh, he placed him in earlier by and himself. Look at that, him. just choking the poor boy and out. He, you condone this, these kind of actions in the ring. Yes. This is... Oh! Drop it. This is becoming quite difficult to watch now at this point. Keith Mayshard is... He's bringing a level of brutality to this match. That is, and that's the thing he wants to do when it comes to opponents like Sammy Young. He wants to give up brutality just like oh, that Death Valley, Valley driver. Again to the back. Massive impact. This, this can do it. Just gets... Are you going. serious? How Just did he kick out of that? Into the oh, oh flapjack! He is he's he's coming back, and it's amazing that he has the energy to pull off a move like this after the abuse he's after taking, and he's after what's this? My what? God! It's, into a single side leg lock, and he's just wrenching back on Kimisha, but look like an a bit close to the ropes, a bit close to the ropes, and better judgment to release for um be forced to release so he can keep control. To a front face lock and takes down the leg again. That was oh, quite come smart on. Sammy Young, you must admit there. Walking round to the back again, raises him up, pulls him up again. I, I'm just outstanded by the tenacity. And again, man. are you serious? The abuse he's after taking to, to come back and work the work the legs after working the arms. And he is doing a, a, an autopsy on, on Keith Mayshard in this ring. He is taking the limbs apart and he's going back to the shoulder here again Watch. oh this time to the turnbuckle post oh <laughs> wait what sammy zong here is putting on a clinic excuse me the ring post because i have to threat myself oh. again as he done it the second time no give in that ring post as he's shoulder that is that is flesh on steel and he's going again third time's the charm oh come on God. how's the referee not <laughs> stopping this his shoulder must be must be in, in an extremely agonizing. And now he's just stomping on him. Are you serious? Just stomping on, just stomping the mohole on him, just walking on him dry. You still oh, come on. Look at the two birds. You can't, you cannot argue. Keep Mayshard has not had this coming to him from all of his actions in the past. Not to mention that the shenanigans he was trying to pull within this ring earlier, choking him off the ropes, and he locks oh, him inside. No. I can't see Mayshard. I just can't see him getting out of this the abuse that's been put on that shoulder. He is writhing in pain. Young is really sitting back into it here. He is. He's just see the way he has the wrist perfectly clasped. 
I may, I may not Rich. like what Sammy Young is and what he does, but I do have to say his ability is Wait, oh, oh. but Mayshaw's ability is way much better than Sammy Young. It's a slap to the face. Now they're going to throw him right to the corner. Double axe hand to the back. What's Mayshaw looking for here? More close fists. Flipping off. My God, the disrespect of this man is... Wait, what? Reverse, reversal. Sammy Young taunts. Bullet shot. He what knows his target. Oh! oh. They're going to go to that KO like knee. Wait a second. Oh my oh, gosh! Oh, turned him inside out with that back suplex. Back, like a Fisher. back neck drop, as people would say. Oh no! What is he? Oh my goodness! No! Come on, you don't do it like this, man! Oh, oh my God! Down on his head! I I can't. I don't think Sammy Young's getting up from that. Good, good. Oh, oh my are God. you kidding me? He just kicked out. I, I, I can't believe this. There is something How? hidden under this man, Sammy Young. There is no How is way. He still going? Keep Mayshard just threw that violence at him. Drop him down in a brain buster. He's setting up again here, though. He's not finished. What's Good. He going for? Oh, what? Counter. What was that? He just pulled out a no. Oh, oh my God. God. Mayshard. That man. He, he's gone. That, that, he can't. Be, he can't be functioning. He, his head is inside out after that. His brains scrambled. Another one. And another one. Come on. Richard, my God. I. I just can't. I can't believe this. Sammy Young. He, to, to kick out of that brain buster and to deliver the impact that he has just put on Keith Mayshare is. This man is a spectacular athlete in his own right. And you, even you, for all your talk, cannot deny that. I'm not liking where this is heading here. Setting him up on the top rope. Wait a second. This is a very dangerous position for the two of them. What? No, 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 no! Oh my god! Returning the favor with a vengeance. Mayshard. No. Motionless. Oh my god. No, the man had enough. Come on, James, move out the way. Sammy Young. Oh, oh my god! Straight punch to the face. Damn it! It, oh my god, he's not done still? Are you kidding me? I don't think Keith Mayshaw should be worrying about winning this match more so than surviving this match at this point. Hard whip. Oh my god! Like a deer in the headlights! Absolutely taken out of it. Again, and he's not finished. He wants to kill him. He wants to do He wants to do some assassination. No! That's it. That's all she wrote. Keith Mayshard not getting out of this one. I'm going to take a kick out. Two, three. Ah! And taking it. And your boy, Keith Mayshard. Damn it! That was a fluke. Absolutely phenomenal performance by Sammy Young. Against a very, very tough and united for Sammy Young. The passion we were talking about beforehand. Shining truth again. Uh, I may not like what Sammy Young does and the brutality he gave, but I cannot deny the fact that he did fall from Texas to Texas. But he made sure he come back another day. As as all bad things do. What a match. Fans just soaking it in with Sammy Young here. Showing their appreciation for the talent and ability this man brings to the ring. Excellent, excellent victory. Exactly. Like only place you've got to so wait. What the? No! Oh my God. Kingdom Cutter! Out of nowhere! Where, where, where did he come from? He was, he was just there at ringside. We didn't even see him getting in. Uh. Just Kingdom Cutter, Sammy Young. After the brutal match that he has just endured, and he's running away before security guards in hot pursuit behind him catch him. Hopefully, someone will take that lunatic. Goddamn legs. Surely someone will catch that man in the back. That, 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 that cannot be tolerated. Sammy Young in the unbelievable performance you have to put in there against Keith Mayshar. Just out of nowhere. This, this lunatic. Bloody Kingdom Star.
Anyway, let me tell you something, Princess. You ain't the master, and this ain't the plantation, son. Tonight, Lance Frisco gets his next seven points. Johnny, I'll see you later tonight. Bring your wife. What? Back to Lions Den, and uh, as you could see, the escalating feud here between Josh King and Lance Frisco. He's been wilding up ever since. I guess a show called Premier Wrestling has, has started. Is, uh, and I have to say, Mark Frisco was impressive, but not impressive he, he enough as Josh King. Uh, come here now. You, you cannot think. This is the man. MVP in PW and I guarantee you MVP wherever he goes this man is one of the hardest workers most loved by all the and audience and so was Josh King Josh King was the best even better than Lance Briscoe he don't have to dance around it becomes some we, weeaboo like I guess is what people call it nowadays I don't know how the internet goes but everybody knows that Josh King was the best performer on PW other than this clown right here should be wearing makeup by the way he is but one thing we can agree on is that internet can lead to some bad things and bad blood is a result of some of the interactions we have seen across twitter and other forms of multimedia that have been left open for these two men to share their true thoughts and here comes oh, my man and his opponent, Josh King, from very accomplished wrestler. Why Josh King. King? Very disrespectful towards Lance Frisco. Recent scene has shown fours in the footage. This is what Gets. I'm talking about. Josh King don't have to dance around and become what do we say? People. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not giving the right for here, but you know where I'm getting at. But what Josh King's likes to do is just be determined, focused, and prepared and ready. This is why he is one of the best workers here in wrestling today. He deserves the attention that he should get as he was in his PW. He had many good matches before, wrestled all around the world from Japan to the United Kingdom, and now here back in America with an Southern score with Josh, excuse me, Lance Christmas. Well, he has a perfect opportunity here presented by Lions Den only place you can see this match prove and back up his words and the accusations he's making towards Lance Frisco let's see what he can bring to the ring two men circling around crowd well in support of Lance Frisco here from what I can I can make out got the arm takes the back into side headlock and if Josh you King haven't seen what happened earlier we had Sammy Young versus Steve Mayshard in which I guess Sammy Young has what did you say? Destroyed Keith Mayshard by nearly killing the man. But here's the thing. Afterwards, I guess the flat, the fat blob named Kingdom Star decides to come in 
and just do some kind of jumping kingdom cutter out of nowhere for some reason. Which I don't know the story about that. Well, one thing we can guarantee you in relevance is... Oh! Hard takedown. Lance Fisco into the pin. One thing we can guarantee you about Kingdom Star is we have buffed up security here at Lions End. Going for another pin. Not even a one count. Making sure that there will be no more interference in post, mid, or pre-matches in any more on Lions Den for the rest of the night. And oh, if we have if we have a good security guard there, how come the security guard didn't attack? Oh! Excuse me, not attack, but get evil from attacking Matt Hayes on one of the editions of Lions Den. Eh? Well, it's probably one of the reasons why we have. Oh! Oh, what a flying! What? Oh my! Okay, I'm not here. To the top. Let's just go. Oh, oh he just, wait! He missed it all. Together. Oh, Are you serious? He faked him out. He faked him out. Is this is this uh, the crowd soaking it up? And Josh King showing no appreciation this, for it. This week, little I guess what I guess the Dante Maddie would say a weak little schoolgirl decides to just dance around. Like I said, Josh King don't have to do all that. He needs to be focused, determined, prepared, and ready. And that is what he is giving him to a worthless Lance Frisco. Well, he's firmly in control here now. Lighting him up with chops, hard whips across the ring, and oh, very hard shot there. Lance Frisco failing the next ball into the floor, goes for the pin, one count. Lance Frisco kicking out with authority. Josh King still firmly in control, lighting him up again. Look at this, laying into him. I can definitely see what you're saying about the focus. And oh, oh, oh what a power bomb. bomb. Neil on his no. Bailing from the ring after the kick out, and he's leading uh, Lance Frisco on some kind of wild goose chase here. Lance Frisco more than happy to oblige him. Come on, running all over the ring. Come on, boys! This ain't Doug Doug Goose. Get in the ring. Two men back in the ring, and Frisco. What's this? Oh, what a maneuver! No, into no, the it can up. end like this. No, right no! Oh, thank you. Josh King kicks out. Lance Frisco reaffirming himself, reasserting himself here in control. Whip into the corner. Hard punch to head. Close Toe kick. This, by the brings way. Him to his, brings him off his feet. Oh, disrespectful hand slaps. Well, he must have overheard you and your close fists uh, comment, and he's happy to oblige. And then these fans are more than happy to cheer for the man. Well, you know Hard what? Job. This man and these fans are somewhat idiots. They just happen to just follow whatever Lance Frisco does. As you can, as you can probably hear in the background, you can probably hear some. I guess what, what do you call it? Black people with Lance Briscoe. Guess brought his homies here. But Josh King, after coming out with that headbutt and sets him up, Ooh. hard kick to the side of the head. Frisco feeling the effects there. Nice Yakuza kick. Goes in, shoots the half into the pin. Only a two count. Lance Frisco kicking out. Take a bit more to take down. A Athlete caliber. Oh, hard whip. Not appreciating Lance Frisco kicking out of his uh, offense and following up only with a two count and a slap of his own. Frisco punch coming back slap, to life here. Punch slap is back to back. Two men going slap happy in the middle of the ring, followed by uppercut. Another slap. Another uppercut. Oh. Frisco takes him by the head. Heavy uppercut. Whips him to the rope. Pulls him back. Oh, uppercut. All the uppercuts he has given him right now, like he's Johnny Cage. Checking the jaw of Josh King, followed by a heavy drop. Explosive. Josh King takes it down, and he lighting up these fans, bringing them in, taking them into this match. He, it's, it's such a part of his offense. Oh my God! Oh. Josh King cutting them off. Fiend Frisco out, feigning the, the delusion, but he was well with his Wait a minute, wits. what is he doing here? Oh! oh. Dropped him down straight on the head. Frisco caught big time there. Pandering. I guess that maybe to push. I guess that was a little joke at Kingdom Star for what he did. Oh my gosh! Josh King has just taken the wind out of Lance Frisco. That could be it. Oh! Frisco showing resilience. Toe kick. And here comes Josh King. All stomping. the frustration he is giving to Lance Frisco. Well, Josh King here is. Uh, by no means uh, being very uh, scientific with his offense, he is clearly, as we can see, stomping on his face, showing no respect whatsoever. He sets him up into an octopus stretch. He has him well tangled up here. As you can see, the leg clasped around the other leg and the other leg, Josh's left leg, 
grasping around the neck of Lance Frisco as he wrenches in an abdominal with the arms. Frisco, oh, powers out of it though to a side slam. How can showing life? How can spread? Uh, how can a 165 pound man get out of that move? Over a 210 pounded man. How does that even work? See, this is where a person with your mindset who looks at these matches only by the stats cannot understand John, or understand Lance Frisco and understand why these fans love him. He has something inside him that elevates him. To, he may have the frame of a 160 pound man, but he has he has the passion and power of the equivalence of a of a tiger in that ring. He just pulls out these maneuvers, yeah, pulls out pure strength and passion. The reason why he's pulling out strength is because he probably have an ice cube in his hands. He's probably <laughs> melting. That that is that there though. Is, is, is oh Josh King turns him around lighting him up after Frisco putting a beat down on Josh King is a, Josh King is an equivalent of a lion and he seems to no be telling no it's a lion's been here telling Lance Frisco that uh, after lighting him up with chops oh big, right ahead and Frisco fell down on himself big 450 splash shoots into the pit Frisco kicking out. Siren. Just big accusing kick. I don't know Not about I don't know about you, but I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna leave myself in water. But I have. Oh. My god, Josh King is uh, telling the ref maybe not the brightest decision to make. Allowing Lance Frisco come back into it. Head scissor. Grabs the head. Into a DDT! My god! What a lens! And two men. Dropping down Lance Frisco, showing the effects of those user kicks. Into the pin. Two count, Josh King just gets the shoulder up. Lance Frisco back in control, Josh King shoulder down. Strikes over chops, punch. Chop again from Lance to Lance, punch from Lance. He has Josh King groggy. He's not showing down anything. He is coming back, heavy strikes here. He is putting it to Lance Frisco, straight into a roll-up cradle pin. One, two, Lance Frisco gets the shoulder up. Showing resilience and heart here. Watch this. Oh my God, what a slam. He just muscled into the ground. Lance Frisco is down and he is, he is, he is not moving very well here. Groggily getting back up. And he fades him out. Uppercut punch. And a flying forearm kick up. Lance Frisco. Setting him up. Oh, wait a second. And well, getting behind this. Here's the big elbow. Oh, no. Fans Don't tell me. He's now about to do what I think he's about to do. And he's going for it. What? He's taunting to the fans. What? Oh, oh my God. A super leg drop. Springboard. I guess, I guess what people say that he's in love with the Coco leg drop. Here we go. He's oh, power no. He's today. He's calling for it. Here it comes. The double drop. The spirit bomb. Takes him right down. Spirit bomb. It's got to be. Oh. oh so thank you. Josh King. Showing that he truly does believe he's the best. Oh. He's well more than alive. What's he looking for here? Heavy. Forearm to the head. Lance Frisco. Another takes another heavy forearm to the head. Josh King off the ropes. And a kid lays the knee into the gut. Follows up with a drop kick to the back of the head. Goes for the pin. Back and up. Kick out. Lance Frisco and fans showing appreciation for Lance Frisco getting behind him. Josh King into the corner. Double axe handle. What's he setting up here? He has him on the top, top turnbuckle. What, what, what is he going for here? Let him go on the oh! oh my God! Straight on the back of his head. Oh my God! Course, excuse me, course, scoop splash. This can do it. Come on. Now. Frisco somehow gets out of that, showing life. Coming back at him, heavy elbows. Throws him to the far side. Josh King. Not a hurricane around 
trapped in. My God, where are these two men pulling this energy out of? They're just going at each other with everything they've got. Well, it's happening, bringing up on Twitter. Fisher. In the past the pin. months, and now. Neither man, neither man willing to lie down for the other. Heavy suplex by Josh King. Taking control again out of those series of pins. Oh, look at this, going for the eye ring. Yeah, he doesn't, uh, he don't need his eyes to, he, oh my. Now, I think we're looking to go back outside. Oh, hard bump there by Lance Frisco. My God! Wait, wait a second. Oh, look at what's this. What's he doing? What's he doing with the steel chair? This is a regular match. What? What's he doing? Wait. Oh! oh did, did you see what he did to his knee? How oh, the referee didn't see the chair? His positioning was completely out. Oh, look, he's covering it up now. Well, he didn't get attacked with the chair, so. This is this is uh, going beyond the, sport, the, the sportsmanship of who's better at this point. This is Josh King. Just oh my God, he's he is he's. I've never seen this side of Josh King before. And to be honest, you, I'm losing a lot of respect for this man. I thought he was more honorable than this. Oh, trust. He, what do you mean? He, what do you mean he's not honorable? He is honorable. He's honorable for beating the hell out of opponents like like Lance Frisco. He's after taking a steel chair and slamming his leg into it. That is, that is, if he, if he cannot beat him in the ring for, for with his own skills, without having to resort to these kind of, and Lance Frisco kicks out anyways, without having to resort to these kind of shenanigans, is beyond me. And the referees have to catch him, but Lance Frisco will have to take him. Well, we have a pin. Him. What's the referee doing? He's trying to put the chair away. That was, that was a five count, I count. Where, where, where's the, and the referee's going again. Lance Frisco is here putting it, taking it to him. Uh, and we got another pin. pin. And, uh, another pin. He's counted on the outside. And Josh King just gets out. And the referee now here is uh, letting Lance Frisco down. He had him there off that fisherman. That could have even been it. But no. Josh King has Big the hard will and power just to kick out of that. Kick out of the five count after using a steel chair. Man doesn't... Uh, Man mustn't believe in himself to some degree if he has to resort to these kind of things. Lance Frisco though firmly back in control. He's taking it to Josh King. Putting it to him after resort to such dirty tactics. Ooh. Big elbow strike. Takes him down. Big elbow strike and into the pit. I won't lie, that very nice elbow strike he did, but Ooh. that one actually went down. Josh King is... Oh, he feigns it and he pulls him up into a... Oh, Mitch and Oku Driver. Driver. Has him stacked up in the pin and Frisco somehow gets a kick out. And, oh, to a crucifix. This. He has him wrapped up by the arms. Just gets out. I don't That's know Frisco how. short resilience. Resilience is my ass. Oh. <laughs> Hard whipped up. As you said, a 160 pound man here obviously giving up a lot of size. And here now and Josh King still in firm control hard whip into the corner Frisco has been taking serious abuse here from Josh King and working the arm to the pin one. Oh. oh powers out kicks out of that one Josh King still establishing control here yeah you have to you have to be thinking that Frisco is feeling the effects from that assault on the outside still could be taunting him What's he setting up for here? Oh! Another Yakuza kick. And he goes to the top. He's he's just stalking him up here. He's, Frisco looks like he's in another world. What's he going for? Cross, Cross body. body! My God. 
this, this, this has got to be it. Frisco is no! still kicking out. How? He's still kicking out. Josh King asking that exact question. Frisco stalking him from behind. Where, 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 where are we going with this? He's turning it around. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Spinning. Spins him into the DDT. Out of nowhere. And the two men are showing the effects of this match. Frisco out of his feet here. Just doesn't know where he is. Falls into the pin. One, two, no, no, no. Oh. Josh King gets out. Your your man showing his own resilience here now, and he coming back with kicks to answer Lance Frisco's chops. Now I'm very. Like I said, going uh, back to back strike. This match has <laughs> been back to back so far. Two of them are just going into each other here. And Frisco lame punches. What into the hell? Putting a bit of fancy. Oh, double punch to the chest. Takes him down. No, oh, no, not this again. Here it comes. Here it comes. Oh, the big elbow. How can anybody even enjoy this? Here we go again. Off the ropes. Bit of swag. Leg around and leg up and it comes down. Josh King just getting up from this. He's really reeling here now as Lance Frisco busting out all that patented offense that the fans here are going crazy over. Punches in the corner. Has Josh King where he wants him here now. Oh, He's man. calling for it. He's going for it again. This, oh, wait. Oh, he just, oh, he pulled it out after the elbow strike. Into the pin. This has got to no, be no, it. No, 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 no. And he kicks out. Josh King is, is really, really take, take it, taking it to another level here with, with durability. But, I, I I I don't know. I don't think he's gonna. He can't get out of this one. Just like my God. Just like Sammy Young. I may not like. Oh! oh! Out of nowhere. I may not like Sammy Young, and I may not like Lance Frisco. I can't give up the heart and will of these competitors. Big drop kick to the knee. Uh oh! What is he doing? Oh no! Here we go. Kneeling oh, super kick. Did you see his neck? His neck has got the best of him instead of his head. And what? How? Kick out. Lance Frisco kicked out. It, oh, no. Josh King is just freaking out here. Lance Frisco is as if he's powering up from that kick to the face. Like he's after waking him up. He's after waking up a demon that it, can Josh King even answer to. He better pray for what he's about to do because he's about to be on the novel table. Oh, what's he setting him up here for? He's up on the table. Josh King after taking that apart right in front of us here. No, I'm out. No, I'm out here. What? My my colleagues after leaving, uh, maybe rightly so. Maybe what, what, what's he going? What, what is what's Lance Frisco doing? Oh my God! He, he just he just Harry carried into the into the table. He is out of it. He's, his eyes are just he's just wobbling around here he's flopping around on the floor in front of us here oh, watch out where are you going get out of here Josh King big suplex on the back of his head on the canvas uh, uh, Lance Frisco uh, we need somebody the referee needs to check on him he, he's literally he was flopping around the floor here he, he's I, there's great concern for him right now it's, it's my colleague is, is here he's, he's, his headset is just flinging on the floor but oh my god Lance Frisco in a car wreck and Josh King more, more than taking advantage off the crucifix into a pin. He's trying to get a pin, but somehow Lance Frisco is, <sighs> is kicking out with this offense. Hello, hello, am I good? Am I good? Y yeah, you're good, you're good. Uh, I, I don't think Lance Frisco is too good now, to be honest. Good. Let's keep it that way, shall we? I, I don't know how he's kicking out. It must be just working off instinct here now at this point. It's. He, you saw it yourself. He was just flopping on the floor in front of us after that. Oh, oh! Would you see that kick for the second Another time? He, he's out kick. cold. What? Where is this coming from? That's what he's, I want to know. The fist. Lance first oh, oh straight away. Oh, Come on. No, no. So many, oh, oh, my God. God. Josh K kicks out. Collision, he, he can't believe it. Lance Frisco, oh, big neck breaker. What is going Josh on? I, I, it, that is a move rarely people would 
be even able to get out of the arena on their own legs after taking, never mind kicking out of, after taking the amount of abuse Josh King's after taking, to kick out of a sling blade. Uh, I don't know where these two men are, are getting this energy from. A big drop down on the neck. And Josh King got back to wake him up from this corner. He's, he's just, he's just in a different zone here right now. Um, maybe looking for the king. Oh my feet! He's, he's after Bernie Lance Frisco! That is like a shot at Joey Legend. The man That's who's a master of the spear. No, he's not done. He may be... Oh no, wait a second. I think I know what he's looking to do. Oh no. Come on, the dude had enough. Oh, down the head. And Frisco just... Oh, that was disgusting right there. That was... Deer in the headlights. I may... I may respect what Josh King has done, but that enough was enough after that spear. After the spear, enough was enough after he dived through that table. That's Frisco. We, we need to get someone to check on him after that. Like, he dived through that table. And, and I got a shot of his eyes there, and the guy was glazed over. The referee checking on him, rightfully so, right now. And Josh King everybody really... May, everybody may be sad for Lance Frisco, but I'm not. I am happy that Josh King is the one standing. He deserves all of what he's all he's worth for. He lives up to the name. He is the king at what he does. And right Josh now, King. we have Enjoy. a main event to be looking for, man. I'm quite excited. How about you? I, I'm very excited. It's it's couple versus couple. Coyo Callez and Avalon versus Shea Knight and Alexis Wellborn. Let's see who has got the matrimony power to overcome the other. And let's see what love story is going to be Risen it all on all our faces that we're going to be annoyed for.
This, 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 Nobody has looked at me the same. No matter how impressive I was in the ring, or how I was for them, they disliked me because of what I personally like. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the debut of came into an RW, I did a photo shoot for some cash, and it involved looking like an elf. And because of that, people in the NRW felt awkward. And labeled me as some fetish girl. I saw that Avalon was experiencing what I was going through, and I decided to put my foot in the door and help her out. got a connection almost immediately. And then we took that chemistry and turned it into a team. And later on, a relationship. I personally feel that there is no better mixed tag team around that is good as us. He disrespects not only others, but he can be disrespectful to me as well. And I don't know what to do. 
trust me. If you think I'm wrong, I'll say you're the best. And just take a look at me being the champion of SES. Take a look at the path of carnage that Lexus has made. There is no stopping us. Me and my girlfriend are paired up against two freaks of nature on the The fact that people can be okay with Sheer and that monster Alexis and not be okay with fairies is disgusting. I'm gonna be facing Koyo the Fury with Avalon on my bike. And I would not be surprised if we catch wind because Koyo can't keep his goddamn mouth shut. And when I beat him? And when I beat him? Then people will understand! Koyo will finally be put back in his place. Hear thee, hear thee, another love story upon your screen. It is the couple versus co- Oh, whoa, whoa what is this? It seems oh, like oh, these two, oh, as and you already seen that, I, mean, I guess some problems in this relationship here. A bit of a tension between lovers it seems all right but uh hopefully it doesn't affect into their performance in the ring now because this is a uh, this is something that should be taken beyond personal little problems this is a main event lion's day when it comes to the main event you got to showcase anything and everything that you got i'm sure both these athletes will as they're both professionals they take their jobs very seriously and they oh want to boy. especially against the opponents that they have on their way to the ring right here right now the king and queen of SBS. Oh these, uh, this these two are married. You, you want to be on the same page for when you're going into the ring. But you're gonna have to this is like I don't know this is like a, a love horror story to be exact because you know you have the former FBS champion she at night along with elevation what is what they call it? The Montana Horror Story, also with the teacher of fear, Alexis Welby. So with a bond like these two, I think it's obvious that you should fear them the most. So she and Knight, for well, both of them combined, is all about brutality altogether. It, it's like going in up against the Manson family when you're not even liking each other. You, you, you gotta, you're, you gotta put up a fight, or you're gonna be, you're gonna get hurt. Indeed. These, these two are uh, someone you don't, you're not gonna, you're not gonna get away with, with that, with messing, messing around with each other. With that. It's like even, even that, that, that sign of unity that the two, the Avalon and Tyo are showing, that's a blood to walk. Indeed. Especially that, plus that girl named Alexa. I don't know, I don't know if I'm gonna call her a girl. I guess we call her a woman. Whatever she is, one thing we can agree on, Connor, is dangerous. Wait a second. What is that? Oh, evidently, no um, dissension in the camp on uh, the other side of the ring to Coyo's dismay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Now that is what we call the friend zone. You're yeah. in the friend zone, my friend. Maybe Ava, or maybe Koyo should be uh, showing more focus in the ring than his uh, most lovely partner here on the apron. And wait, whoa, backflip! Wait a second, what is this? Oh! <laughs> oh! Draws on a big boot. Add another to boot. Already uh, looking to start off. Uh, big knee. This is a. Uh, this is uh, not the way I imagine Koyo wanted to start this match. Indeed, I don't, I don't think you want to get in the face of someone named Shia Knight. Trust me. Shia bouncing off the ropes. Koyo showing a bit of power, uh, muscling him up. and A big knee. Koyo is uh, showing a bit of life after that. Uh, oh, and he's uh, caught and oh. dropped it through a reverse atomic drop even. And straight into the pin. Goyo's wrestling style is always reflected of his cat persona that he had back in the independent. While Shia is all about 
kind of the same as like Sammy Young, but this time he knows a way to calm himself down at some, at some time here. This is a man who feeds his momentum by violence and rage. He, uh, he goes into that ring and it's the same formula that gets him through every time. He's going to hurt his opponent and he's going to hurt him a lot more than his opponent's going to hurt him. He also disrespects every opponent that he steps Big in the ring Uzo. with. Big shooting star press there. Oh! oh there goes she. A bit of a teamwork on part of uh, Athlon. Wait a second. Big oh! Uzo to the outside. Maybe she's a bit more impressed with Koyono at this point. Could be. She uh, caught up by the head here. Big uppercut by the cat man. Koyo well in control here. Throwing him back into the ring. Taking his time to get back in himself. And Shia comes to his feet. Only to be caught off of the ropes by him. Koyo. Oh. Okay. Seems like Alex. Seems like Alexis won it. Wait, never mind. What? Oh, looky, she got. Oh, what is it? Oh! She was just calling him into a power bomb. My God, the patented Pierre been so, bomb. Maybe Koyo shouldn't have been so hesitant uh, <laughs> with his offense there, giving Shia a moment. This is a man you do not give a moment to breathe. Definitely. And he's firmly back in control here now, flinging Koyo to the ground. I don't know who to go for here in this, in this match here. I suppose. Uh, well, it might become a bit more evident to you now with uh, Miss Miss Violence herself coming in and she wants a piece of Koyo. More than happy to dish it out to him. And she's laying punches into him. Uh, if we were, if we were going to talk about gender equality here, is this not uh, breaking the rules? Could be, but I don't see the referee counting. And I don't referee. think he want to. He, he Maybe a bit of intimidation uh, <laughs> on, on the part of, uh, of the instigator here in Violence. And, Koyo is caught in the corner and Wait a without, second. Uh, without Avalon coming into Wait, the Wait, what the? She just flinged Shia Knight onto Koyo. Oh! Koyo then into a German suplex. Holding on for the pin. Koyo is uh, bearing the blunt amount of an awful lot of offense here. And Avalon must be showing concern for her uh, tag partner here. Into a verified mo version of a sleeper. I think it's called the Dream Street, is it? I believe so. That's, that's more like a million, million dollar, dollar dream. dream. There and you go. Koyo, Koyo fighting out. Oh, lovely. Flings him over the shoulder. Gets out of that predicament. And on it's net snap. He is uh, showing signs of life here again. Rallying some offense here. Right back at Shia. Off the drop kick now. Sets him up. Throws him to the corner. Oh. Brings Avalon in now. That's... Give them a taste of their own medicine, I suppose, and out oh. and off the second rope into a double handle. She has it right back. More double teaming here now. Oh, look at this. And she has been held down by the woman. Two of them are holding oh. on. Oh, big Enziguri. Coyle putting some serious offense on him. Two. And she gets the shoulder up right now. Coyle whips him into the corner, into... Uh, Hopefully, bring in uh, for the first time woman on woman action that we're going to have in this ring. And oh. might, might be, uh, uh, here comes our partner now, uh, hoping for some big finger point. Or, oh, bit of uh, oh. incurring the wrath. Bringing it on now. Uh, I don't know if that was so wise of a uh, taunt to exhibit at such an aggressive young female here who could take down Coyo. <laughs> Never mind what she could do to herself. Avalon is. Uh, Definitely reaping the rewards of uh, of incurring that that kind of uh, reaction. Speaking of Avalon, Avalon did have a long history of doing modeling for at least some money, as he said earlier. Here, oh whoa whoa, look at me! <laughs> she just catching her with fist off a kick to the fist. She might uh, want to be uh, considering going back to modeling uh, after this because if she stays in this ring much longer, she will be not accepted in Danny Modeling Company. This is a face, facial workover she's getting off those punches. Alexa is very, Alexa is very known for bringing brutality in the women's division. You can almost say that she's almost equivalent to Shia, but she's, she's pretty, let's just say she's way more than Shia than himself. 
Jesus. Um, from all I can see is uh, elect she's asking these questions of Avalon and there, there's absolutely no response here. It's like she has no answers for this brutality that's been wrought on her. All we can see is just she's getting taken apart here. Been absolutely whoa, taken apart. Whoa. Look at this a bit of agility to match the power that she was exhibiting earlier on. And Koyo obviously showing mass frustration on the outside. Crying out for that tag. Needs to get back into this ring now because Avalon is is she is not uh, not not up to the challenge right now as it's showing against Lex. Oh, Where is the goal? So what a side slam exhibiting some power of her own and she's firing up here now. Kicks her into the ropes and out of the ring. Bit of life being shown, more resilience than I thought was in this young lady. Wait a minute. It's not the couple looking to trying to regroup new group here oh well, uh, seems to have done so maybe uh oh giving maybe that breather might whoa look at this lifting her off the canvas and slamming her back down by the, the, the hair extremely vicious offense elevates her again lifts her whoa. She looking for here oh my god slams her down with authority oh off the ropes oh Fans are here at ringside is she out to the out. She's sitting on the apron here and a hard punch. And Avalon is just after being knocked down out of the ring here and is, is trying to regroup herself and goes to Koyo. Koyo asking questions of Avalon. Maybe not the wisest with an Alexis Avalon. Oh! Koyo provides the distraction, hindering his own tag partner. Uh oh. What? What is Koyo doing? And he just, for his efforts, he's taken out by Shia. I don't think you want to question Alexis what she's doing whenever she is right there. Oh, let's go back to the, the ring. ring. You can see, uh, despite being uh, taken out by that, uh, that heavy dive, we have uh, Avalon is begging Alexis to get back up. She looking for here. Oh. Big DDT. Wait a second. Wow. She planted her. And, well, well, she's not done. Ooh. My God, to the back of the head. What? Well, Definitely say that was a, a tight turning fence there and a kick to the back of the head and barely gets the shoulder off. Lex is reeling from it. Avalon firmly in control here now after Avalon considers herself to be a rookie but shy sometimes to at least go for the big move that most of the men does. That's evident but Alexis is definitely bringing, or uh, excuse me, Avalon bringing a, a, a different demeanor here than what she has started off with herself mean streak in this girl and she's really tearing into Alexis I suppose it's the only look at this transitioning from the chin lock into this dragon sleeper she's wrenching back into it Alexis in trouble here oh maybe she was wrenching too far into it allowing Alexis to plant those knees one of on her the panic, forehead one of her panic things is her knees that you really want to stay away from maybe putting her head towards those knees was not better look that at this oh, oh my god God, elevated into a backbreaker. Patented how Nelson backbreaker. Exhibiting that power you were you were pointing out earlier, and Koyo is showing massive amounts of frustration on the outside. Really looking to get back into this ring here now. He seems to be not happy with Avalon right now. No dissension shown on the other side by uh, oh big kick. Avalon after pulling herself back into it after that kick and straight into the suplex bridge beautiful bridge showing at least got the there. job done off a two count and she whips next into the corner and bringing Koyo in now it is a whips her to the other side and doing the honorable thing I suppose oh I spoke too soon crotching her on the top rope and punching her in the face a monkey flip very unique offense it's the legal man here you must imagine is is, is Koyo, Avalon, still in the ring. The referee not doing too much. Off the Hurricane Rana. What's Koyo looking for here? What? Oh my god, he just dived on her. He just killed her. Are you serious? Payback for the offense that she was. If I suppose if you're going to mix it up with the boys, you got to be willing to take it, equality and all. Well, she does know how to get it in with the big boys. Especially, especially the big boy known as Shia here. 
<laughs> who makes his presence felt with a toe kick. Oh, Koyo catches. You know, you know she can't control. be happy with that. Mocking him. That might not. Two men are mocking each other here from the kicks. Oh! And Chia has enough of it and takes him down with a heavy forearm to the face. Follows with a heavy punch to the face. Oh, Koyo catches him. Flings the arm back. Another kick of his own. Follows up. What's he looking for here? Sunset oh, flip! Oh, sunset flip into the pin! Gets two. Just after that, I just I just absolutely want to go with Shia and Alexa because you're you're a man. You're not supposed to attack women. It doesn't matter if they make you angry or I guess some type of way. You're not supposed to do that. Koyo, uh, Koyo is on fire right now, but one must beg the question. He was hindering his own team earlier, providing a distraction on Alexis. And as you mentioned yourself, rather shady uh, offense to, to turn on them. Um, young Alexis but I, I am one who believes in equality and oh my god what a maneuver straight into the pin off of Dragon Rana I I, I, I as I was saying though I, I I believe in equality and if, if she's willing to get into that ring and do it to Koyo why can't Koyo do it to him I look at his predicament he's after putting Shia in good hitting oh, him what a done Shia showed great resilience here Koyo is all over him absolutely laying into him with offense. I suppose he is after having a very long rest on the outside. He is expending those energy reserves right on Shia. Look at this rapid fire strikes followed by an elbow the off the ropes. The rumors say that Koyo is actually jealous of Shia for having a fellow life than what he has. Wow, what a strike. Koyo is not maybe the case, but if that is the fuel he's using to win this match, he could be set himself on a course to do so. Could be the Koyo, case. Again off the ropes. Elevating, showing that cat-like agility. Big elbow again. First elbow off the ropes. Koyo is just, it's all Koyo right now. Wait a second. Look for the, oh! Big kick to the face. Alexis showing concern for her man, trying to get into the ring. The referee pushing her back out. Koyo's going for the pin, but the referee's distracted. I don't think you want to get distracted that, at that some point. That is more than the three count at this point. I guess more of a five oh, count. I'd say so. Wait. No, 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 no! Oh, my God! End of existence! He, he just, he just obliterated, he obliterated him. That is a legit end of existence. My God, Koyo is off the distraction. Turns around and the end of existence and Shia. Oh, man. <laughs> I have no words for, for that maneuver. It, it was it was vicious, to say the least. Koyo still short for the next one. And the happy couple rejoice in the rain, I suppose. We're gonna get another glimpse of the happy couple. <laughs> uh, celebrating as they do, I suppose. Ah, you, the, ah, you love birds. To the dismay of much of the audience, as well as Avalon here, who is very annoyed with Koyo, who's Still breathing in agony. And oh, oh, she's saying it's over. What? It's, I don't know if he quite heard that, like, capable of hearing. It might be still hearing the bells in the ear, but we most certainly heard it here, and the fans are. Oh my god, what are they doing? Don't do this to the poor man. Aww. His heart has just been broken. The, but then again, a love story has happened for both Alexis and Sia Knight. They continue. This the rain of terror. night, we'll move on, have a honeymoon, and we'll happily ever after. The end. They're happily ever after, just probably happily ever after for everyone else. Definitely. Especially anyone who has to get into the ring against this dangerous duel. Indeed. No. Nope. Shia, on the bike. Some words here now from Shia. Lion's Den. The last time I've been here is that I had to go against Andrew Lennox, Ram has been in. Kevin Cathmore and even had to call out Devin Constantine, who still never accepted nor declined my request for a championship. And you know what happened at the final match for that championship? Kevin Cathmore just decides to be a sneaky little cunt and just attack me from behind while I wasn't looking. Huh. You wanna know what else is funny about that? It happened to, to the same four people. 
You know the same people poor people are? People like London Faze, Robin Faze, Alex Daniels, and Leo Monson. about you but this is pretty bizarre I don't know what we're seeing in front of us right now oh I guess this Big. is the previous events of what happened on Ryzen and straight from the den itself he goes right there and cutting the static and that oh spear to the barricade really ouch Zara intimidating looking man just after driving that human anatomy. Oh, it looked like, like this will happen on versus Japan. Oh my, that's Leo Matsu. He's just he's just beating down on him. All four. Both London, Alex Daniels, Leo Matsu, and Robin Fell. Oh my wait a sec. No! Just absolutely broke him into the concrete floor. You wanna know what else is funny here in this situation? That they're all four of those guys are SVS people. And you wanna know who else is still is the SVS person? Take a wild guess. Me. And it's really starting to piss me off. For all I know, he can go for any other SVS person that's still standing here in line with him. He can go after my girl. He can still go after the four people that I just announced. Hell, the person he will not go against is me, because I am standing here, I am ready, I am ready for a fight, As a matter of fact, I'm ready for a war, so whoever you are back there, I want you to come on out here, I want you to fight me like a man, one on one, face to face, so come on out here! Oh no. There's his lady, up on the, up on the ramp by herself, uh, plotting her man, addressing the situation, SVS. Indeed. Oh, oh my god! god! He just kicked her in the side of the head! What the hell? This masked lunatic! What the hell? She is in shock! Oh no! Oh no! This is gonna go worse from here! Here we go! The two of them are just going out of here on the outside. Get him, Shia! Get him! Unmask this this lunatic! Expose him for what he is! Exactly! Expose this garbage of a person! And wait! Oh! He's got the mask off! Wait! What's that? Tino Rouge! What? That's Tino Rouge! What the hell? What is Tino Rouge doing? What the hell? What the hell is the cause of this? What is going on? He's just he's just asking the exact same question himself. Oh my god! Oh my god, what the hell has happened here on Lion's Den? The, the mystery man exposed this northern Tino Rouge. What is his motive for all these horrible attacks? My god, these events are still still just circulating here now. What the hell? Oh my... That's all the time. 